Hey, you want to make some money? Of course you do. Well, very simple game. Just keep track of the ace. It's very simple. There's the ace. There's the ace. There's the ace again. Just keep track of the ace. Where is it? Was that too fast? Oh, it's this one you say. Alright, smart guy. Double or nothing. Again. The ace. The ace. The ace. Keep track of it. No. I, I don't know which one it, you do. Magic tricks. And that is the extent of all the magic tricks I know, other than making a teacher's phone disappear. Fun fact, I used to do pickpocketing. Stage pickpocketing, I never stole anything! But I would steal your phone in your pocket, be like, ha, got your phone here, yeah. But, uh, yeah, that is the extent of my magic. Other than, uh, I, can, I, I can do this. Oh, oh my lord. Oh my lord. Or, if you're interested, the anti-gravity core, anti-gravity, the anti-gravity, the anti-gravity, the anti-gravity, the anti-gravity, the anti-gravity. Or, my personal favorite, it only ever existed in your mind. Only exists in your mind. Only exists in your mind. But other than that, my manager is kind of shit. So today we're going to fix that. So when we get out of quarantine, I can show this off to my little cousin when he comes over to my house. And... Demons under my bed. Also, I'm gonna be experimenting over the next couple of videos with lighting and stuff. Last video, I changed settings, but didn't add any lighting. Uh, this video, we have. Oh, so cool! I want to add one over here too, but uh. I also just realized that my mic was like on the other side of the room, so I have to use this camera's mic, which I have no idea how that's gonna go. But so I have a couple of videos here that we are going to watch together. For the sake of magic. Hey, you know the vibe! I hope all of y'all are having a fantastic day. Thank you so much. I wanna fucking kill myself. And I better see y'all. Yo, back up! Hey, you know the vibe! Hey. What's going on, guys? Sean is magic here. Back at it. I, I don't know why I'm bullying this guy so hard. <laughs> I'm just, I'm so sorry. I just haven't. It's been a long time since I've watched a YouTuber go so hard in an introduction. Like, hey! Let's build money! Oh, I should also probably mention, I'm gonna be like shitting on this guy a little bit but it's all in good fun if you see this somehow my channel's really small if you see this <laughs> thanks i can't believe it got any recommended but um yeah if you see this don't shit on this guy i'm just doing good fun we're gonna take the nine and we're gonna lose it into the middle of the deck shuffle it up a little bit and uh you know i'd even give it a nice little shuffle like so now we're gonna grab a random card here. For example, uh, the the Jack of Clubs. This is not your card, obviously. Uh, and but what we're gonna do is we're gonna set it on the table and just place your hand right on top of that Jack. All right, cool. Now what we're gonna do is a little bit of magic. We snap our fingers, and just like that, that Jack turns us into one card and one card only. The Nine Damn. of Diamonds. That's Your actually a good card. one. All right, so for this card trick, what I'm gonna need you to do is uh, just go ahead and touch the back of any of these cards. So uh, let's say this one right here. Let's take a look at what card you picked. You picked the, uh, the Six of Diamonds. We're gonna take the Six, we're gonna lose it roughly into the middle just like so. And then what I need you to do is just cut the cards anywhere you want. Now halfway, a little more, a little less. You go ahead and cut the cards. And I'm gonna take the rest of the cards and we're gonna mark where you cut. Now, you could have picked any card. Your card is lost somewhere random in the middle of the deck. Uh, there are 52 cards in the deck, but somehow, how did you cut perfectly to your card? The six of diamonds, just like that. That one is really cool. Jesus. Too. God, I, I haven't been that hyped ever since my... I'm not funny. So long. Last magic trick, what we're gonna need are the two aces. What we're gonna do is we're gonna have the card shuffled up and mixed, and we're gonna have a card selected, for example, uh, the Jack of Clubs. We're gonna take the Jack That's really nice into hands. the middle of the deck, shuffle it up a little bit, and then we got the two aces here. Here's one ace right here, and then here is the second ace. Um, like so, we got both aces here. We're just gonna leave that on top of the deck and go ahead and cut the cards. So they go ahead, take the cards, they give it a cut, they complete the cut, 
and then uh, you literally give it to them in their hands and you say just snap and just like that when they spread through the cards there'll be one card in between the two aces look at that it caught one card one card only their card the jack of clubs all right so this is what i'm going to use to flex on my little baby cousin let's see it dude all right, all right there's a three really these are three really easy card tricks you can do like so literally like Cut the cards like so. If I can't understand it, then of completing the cut like you so, guys probably can. I'm not very intelligent. And this is what is called a pinky break. Literally, do this on the table if you don't want to do it one-handed. So say their card is on top, they have the Joker, okay, and you say, hey, we're gonna mix the Joker into the middle. We'll take half the cards, put it right here, and then we'll take the other cards and we'll put it on top. Now, when you put it on top, you're literally just gonna put your pinky right there to hold a little break okay. like so. So now you got, um, you literally. Okay, so I've I, I have the. Mm. When he's holding it, the only thing that he hasn't... He's holding it like this, I guess, in such a way where the cards, cards like, from the front doesn't look, like, super weird. But because I have huge fingers, it's much more natural for me to hold it like this or something. Which isn't very subtle, to say the least. I have to strain. You can see my hand shaking to hold it that way. Oh, yeah, that's better. And all in all, it would look like this. They pick a random card, for example, the two hearts. You say, okay, watch the two. We're gonna lose into the middle of the deck by cutting it and losing into the middle. And then you got the break right there. You just insert your pinky. You say, okay, we're gonna give it a few more cuts, uh, like so. And then you can literally keep repeating the same process um, of, of cutting the cards and then putting it back. I just lost it. Um, the easiest way, again, is literally just go, okay, your cards are lost somewhere in the deck. You have two cards in your hand and then you insert your pinky and you place the two cards above your pinky. And now all you do is you lift two cards at once. There you go. That's literally it. You say, okay, this is not your card, the Joker. Okay, cool. We're gonna take it. We're gonna set that Joker oh. down. But in reality, this is the two, the Joker. Oh, so, okay, so this is the card. And then you just go, wha bam Hey, dude, hey, dude, 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 dude. This ain't your card. And, and, and I know this ain't your card. <laughs> Fuck. Oh! Boom! It's your card! Woo! If this ain't the way to get anime bitches, I have no idea how else you would. Alright, we're just gonna do coin tricks. Um, <clears throat> Similar to my incredibly impressive coin trick that, that you see me doing right here. Me, Dead Memes YT, doing the magic trick. It's not that hard to do. But uh, we're gonna learn a couple more. The coin visually changes. That's... Now chat, I got, I got, I'm not gonna lie. Chat! Now guys, I'm not gonna lie. I learned, I, I, I saw one of the magic tricks before this just to see if they were any good. Now, I am very good at rubbing, alright? Rubbing is my passion. And I'm... <clears throat> rubbing is my passion. And with the power of rubbing... It's gone. It only existed in your mind. Yeah, you probably heard it if you were paying attention. I just went -da 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 under my hand. You keep doing this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep rubbing, and then keep continue to rub. It into his right hand. He turns his hand over, and the coin jumps from his right hand. You just chuck it over left. to your other hand. Maybe because my webcam is kind of bad, but like you can. Okay, bro, just. How's I doing it perfectly when you couldn't see it? Extend your middle finger slightly and pull back on the coin. This will cause it to flick behind the other coin into your hand. As this happens, it looks as if the coin is changing. Simply perform this move under the cover of your other hand in whatever way you like. Extend your middle finger slightly, pull back on the coin, and it will reveal the smaller coin. Okay, that's not actually not, not terrible. It looks awkward. Hmm. It's alright. Remember, I'm very lazy, so... so I'm not going to be practicing this. Is. What? What was that? The magician takes a coin, shows it to the spectator, and it visually vanishes. 
Okay, that one's actually really he cool. He then picks out something from the air and reproduces the coin. Is he hiding it, like, in his... Okay, I probably should have been doing this from the start, but I'm going to predict that he's hiding it in his palm. Because there's a little bit of time where you can't Vision. really see. Vanish. Okay, this is... Fuck. Oh, oh! No, it's here. I've seen stuff like this before. Look at this. It, it, it's just this. He's hiding it behind his, his thing right here. It vanishes. Now, obviously, you don't be a jackass like me. And like, like, oh, where could it be? No, these two fingers are married. They can't split up, or else our children will be forever scarred. But yeah, if you're like, oh. you know, that's my theory. That's, that's my theory. This trick requires a single coin. Then extend your first finger. Yeah, that's right. Finger. Requires a single coin. Place it between your first finger and middle finger using your thumb, and then extend your first finger and middle finger in an open position as shown. From the front, it will look as if there's nothing in your hand, when in reality the coin is hiding what? behind it. Simply do this move under the cover of your other hand as you pretend to take the coin. It will appear as if the coin has vanished. Okay. To produce it. Look at this. Look at this coin. Shut up. And it's gone. But then again, I can't. I, 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 I can't. I can't break the, the the laws of physics. That the coin has to be somewhere. It's right here. God, I am way too lazy to fucking do that. Uh, so really anyway, I could just shortcut it. Yeah, I guess. Missing card though, is that is that gonna be an issue? Yeah, good point. I'm gonna blow your mind. See this deck of cards? Completely randomized order. In fact, if you don't believe me, I'll shuffle it up a bit. Still completely random. But watch this shuffle. Just like that, all of the cards in perfect suit in a miracle order. But that's not all. I can make this coin disappear. Oh, hey, what's up? Thank you for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Table of the